Bring a little cheer to the hospitals and clinics for sick children in Ukraine. That's exactly what a couple of young artists decided to do to help kids get well sooner. These two believe walls can help with the healing process. And color plays a big role in how kids perceive their stay at the doctor's office. There is book therapy and this is art therapy. A type of treatment, so to speak. When a child sees something beautiful, it helps much more than gray walls. The kids like the paintings and the doctors say it actually makes them feel much more at home rather than at a hospital. It's a symbol of comfort, a pet cat, the storks, home, all the symbol of a Ukrainian household. So far, their work can be seen in doctors' offices across Ukraine, from neurologists to dentists and even 14 different hospital wings. They usually work only in state-run facilities because they tend to be painted either in grey or beige only. Their work is truly a labor of love. It doesn't come cheap. Paint, brushes, stencils, all can easily add up to a hefty sum. The supplies alone for their work for the cardiology unit at this children's hospital cost them about 500 U.S. dollars. They never take money from the doctors, though. Everything comes from private donations and social media crowdfunding campaigns. The paint is always non-toxic, acrylic base, because it lasts much longer. Usually, the walls built during Soviet times were out of the sand. If we use old based paint, it will chip right away. So that's why all those grey walls are chipping and people think it's the norm. It isn't. We need to change that, make the new generation happy. Helena's next project is painting nearly 100 square meters of children's hospital in Kharkiv this fall. She says she is looking forward to making winters feel a little warmer there.